how's everybody doing we got a new product to review it's the new milwaukee orbital veto sander kit product number 2531-21 ho to be honest with you i did not need more batteries i did not need another charger but for 30 dollars more i got the extra battery and the extra charger that i'm not a big fan of you know what i'm talking about it's the m12 chargers those are not that good i do not use them i have like five of them or six i've lost count but anyways for, like i said for 30 dollars more why not regular price i think it's 149 just for the tool this one right now it's for 179 and that's because of the holidays it's supposed to come out in august came out to the end of october but whatever we got it here now <laughs> let me show you the box i don't know if you guys can see it hope you guys can but that's all we got nothing too crazy i will show you all the writing and stuff but who really pays attention to that kind of stuff i don't i hope you don't either but let's get into it i already took it out of the box i'll show you right now what's in it let's go all right so here's what's in the box let's go ahead and open it get it open for you all right there it is so like i said m12 charger that a lot of people don't care for <laughs> tool itself and I forgot to mention it's the new kind of battery the high output 2.5 I put the date on them I bet I started doing this actually not too long ago just so I could keep track on when I got the battery so like that I think these only have two-year warranty so in two years if they stop uh, performing how they they're supposed to I just send it in and they give me a new, another one the how many was it 18 of them uh, 80 grit 120 180 this cool right here and this tells you right here they come in 80 120 150 180 220 320 and 400 i got these last two uh just because i work with those a little bit more but i might get 80. so there's that there's a battery i already showed you a little tool the allen wrench to change the i guess the pad when it messes up all right so in here you got the little sponge so that's cool i already seen that they sell these two and uh, not too sure what this is about. I'm pretty sure it's to put on top of this if you don't wanna, just to get a little smoother surf. I don't know. I'm not gonna sit here and act like I know what this is for. Okay, instructions on the this, and then instructions on the tool itself. Just go with the tool. Get out of the plastic. All right, so there it is. There's the tool itself. Allen key. Like I said, I think this one maybe you want you do want to put this on here and just use it with this on here. Went ahead and charge the battery. And there it is. Looks good. Looks good, good. We're gonna go ahead and try it on that. It's black paint. And also I got these two right here. We got the this one is uh 320 and I got the 400 so this is how they come the 12 pack I think there's a 36 pack as well but that's this right here so let's try it out over there see how got the 400 grit just go ahead and throw it on there it is let's try it out That's full speed right there. Have the trigger all the way in. I'm letting go of the trigger right there. And that's almost nothing right there, the trigger. So that's cool. Oh, you also got the, right here. So, let me see if you guys can see. That's on one, trigger all the way in. So it has variable, variable speeds or whatever you call this. All right, this is two. Three, four. Okay, let's try it in one. Trigger all the way in. I think one, 
one would be great for um, for paint finishes like this that I just want to smooth out the paint a little bit because I'm gonna glue stuff on top of this so I think this is probably the best look at the sandpaper it's getting a little bit clogged let's uh let's go ahead and blow it real quick with the compressor see how it comes up so there it is I cleaned it up with the compressor it did come off pretty good I think if I wash it it should clean up but I, I don't want to do that right now but let's keep on doing this oh yeah I forgot battery indicator right here and then to keep the trigger down this little button right here so that's cool it's another good feature let's see if it does it like this I oh, know it has to be all the way in so there it is this is really cool I, I once I, I knew this was coming out I was literally checking every day online in August for it to come out this is really gonna help me out on my projects that I do I could use the other sander they're a little bit heavy and sometimes you want to do little stuff you know like pieces that you have to sand and I think this is perfect for that I do a lot of a lot of signs a lot of wood signs and acrylic signs and stuff like that so I think uh, this is really perfect 400 grit good it's really really good there it is again look a little bit clogged up but again let me show you guys let me show you guys just see how that came out I don't know if you were able to see that but I don't want to blow dust all over my shop but it does come off for sure it does come off I'm pretty sure when you wash them they'll clean up really good and this is paint remember that too this is paint so pretty good all in all I like it a lot um, still gonna try the sponge I think the sponge is more for like for corners or like little grooves and stuff like that I don't need that right now um, I would try it out for this but I don't have nowhere to try it on so I even try it but it looks like it is gonna work too so there it is 10 out of 10 Milwaukee got this right I do not think they're gonna come out with a second gen for this I'll be honest with you this is I think too perfect unless they made one that the battery goes on top and you could just hold it like that you know just a little but I don't know I don't know what but this is good I like it all right thank you guys for watching uh you guys are interested it's on sale right now for the holidays go get you one all right